All right, here's how we set up a dray. Listen for a loud click. Verify that it is hooked in and it's not going anywhere. If you carry your leg straps in your pouch, which I do, go ahead and pull them out. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that the hook is facing downwards. Thread it through your D-ring. Stop whenever you hit the center of the leg strap. Unhook, wrap it around the inside of your leg, hook it into the loop, repeat on the opposite side, and now you're ready to climb the tree. Once you get to climbing height, install your tether on the tree. I like to keep my tether somewhere between my eyeballs and the top of my head. I'm gonna slide my ascender up, start pulling your hammock out of its pouch. And you'll notice you've got your bridge for your hammock and then the carabiner is already attached. Slide the carabiner over to the left and go ahead and pass your body through that bridge. Now I'm ready to clip in. Once I'm clipped in, I will go ahead and uh, tighten my screw gate on my carabiner up. Once you sit down in it, go ahead and make sure that you've got some tautness on that middle line. Now you're ready for real comfort. I can take this material here and wrap it all the way up around my head and I am completely pressure free. Now in this position, there's a couple things you can do. You can go ahead and take these and push them up and they are pressic loops like any other. So once you push them up, they'll stay up when you put pressure on them. You can adjust the position of where your back is riding. You can get straight up in 90, 45 it, or you can go all the way back. Whenever you're tucked up in the dray, if you notice, my entire inside is hidden from any animal that, that's walking down below me or beside me. The only thing they'll see is this right here, your head moving. And even then, you're completely hidden. You hear a stick pop. When you go to shoot, you're going to notice that this is going to completely support my chest. And if my chest is stable, I can sit here and hold my bow back for a very, very long time. You can have this portion down all the way towards your knees if you want to, or you can have it back here. It doesn't matter, you can put this wherever you want to. Check this out. Ah, Once you're tied into your linesman's loop and you're ready to release load off, you're gonna slide your carabiner off to your right, and you're gonna pass your body through the loop that is created. I'm gonna take my pouch and move it over here to where I can access it. And you're gonna take this side and you're gonna tuck it into the corner. You're gonna zip it up just a little bit. Now you're gonna come take your other side, your other cinched hammock side along with the carabiner. You're gonna take that carabiner, you're gonna push it in the bottom left corner of the pouch. Now take your middle, roll it in there. Your main line you're gonna to wanna to push until the pressic hits the zipper. I can go ahead and take my leg loops off I'm gonna unhook the first one and reattach that loop. Unhook my other side, hook this side back up, slide that out, fold this up, stick that in the top there. Follow your finger with the zipper. Put your finger below the zipper, and as you zip, that will keep the fabric from riding and getting into the zipper. When I go to slide this around, you'll see that the main line pulls out a little bit, and it'll pull out just where you need it, where it'll keep it taut, nice, and packed in still to your pouch. There you go. That's the dray.